I was taught under the conventional paradigm that coal takes a long time to form and it forms in the bottom of a swamp. But that's not what we're seeing here. No, that's not what we're seeing. If it was a swamp, several things would be uh, true of what we're looking at. First of all, if it's a swamp, you've got trees growing mm -hmm. rooted in soil. Mm -hmm. So you would expect to see roots in the material underneath the coal. And what do you see? You see logs. I don't see any, I don't see any uh, roots in here. And underneath modern swamps, you've got lots of roots all over the You're place. Right. So we don't see that. Plus, think of the bottom of the swamp. Do you think the bottom of the swamp is nice and oh, flat? Yeah. No, it's not. It's, it's as uneven as the surface mm -hmm. would be with mm -hmm. all these trees sticking up in it. We don't have trees growing from, through the coal down into the, into the material underneath. We've got this flat surface. All of a sudden, we've got coal. Yeah. And in a swamp, if you dig up the stuff in the swamp to see what kinds of plant material, there's lots mm -hmm. of plant material in there. But if you pick it up, it's, well, Steve would describe it as coffee grounds. It's a good okay. description. More fine than Yeah, the, the roots growing through this stuff messes it up, mm -hmm. bioturbates it is what we call it, and, and destroys the structure. You can't find pieces of bark in there. They're not recognizable. They're tiny little fragments. You can't find branches. They've been broken up and they're unrecognizable. Leaves are unrecognizable. So if that's what coal was formed from, you wouldn't find pieces of bark in it. But that's what Steve was finding in his coal scene, chunks of bark. Yeah. So he's got a flat bottom, chunks of bark, and then a flat top. If you got a forest growing there. How do you shave the forest off flat right. so that the coal stops all of a sudden yeah. and it allows you to get a very, very flat surface? How does that happen? make any sense? So the conventional explanation with a swamp over long periods of time just didn't work.